Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna walk you through what to do if your FaceTime keeps failing, or say it's, you know, it's failed, this call has failed. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. There are kind of two different things that we'll walk through and go through the steps on. The very first thing and the most common issue is because there's a bad internet connection either from you or the person that you're trying to call on FaceTime. So either you or them. So what you'll want to do is walk through these steps, but also ask the other person to walk through these steps as well. So let's go to Safari here, and then let's just type in speed test and run a quick speed test. If this is anything over say 10 or 15 megabytes per second, it should be fast enough to have a FaceTime video call without it failing. However, if this is, you know, two, three megabytes per second, it's crawling, it's really slow, then potentially the issue is your internet connection. Again, have the other person run the same test and tell you, you know, what is their internet speed? You know, what's their internet connection like? If it's bad, one of the things you can do is swipe down from the top right here and then switch from Wi-Fi over to cellular data or your cellular network. Again, if you're on cellular network, you can always just try to connect to a Wi-Fi network if you have a bad signal in that area. So if you have a bad connection, just switch from one to the other to see if that helps, see if you get better internet connection so that you can try FaceTime and it won't say call failed. Now, the next thing that you can do is if you both have good internet connection, but it keeps saying the call has failed, you can head out of here and then let's go into settings here and then scroll down until we find FaceTime. So tap on FaceTime and you can see a little toggle button right next to FaceTime. You'll wanna to toggle that off and then leave it for say 10 or 15 seconds and then toggle that on again and then have the other person do the same thing, go into FaceTime, toggle it off and then toggle it back on again and then try to make that call and see if that call fails. Now the last thing that you can do is just try to restart both of your phones. So tap and hold the power button and the volume up button and then slide to power off. So power off both of your phones and then restart them. That should refresh everything if there was kind of maybe a memory issue or a glitch on your iPhone. That should help clear up everything and get your FaceTime working in so you can make those calls and it won't keep saying call failed and you know cutting off that call midway. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.